Greetings folks, hope you're well. I've been put off making videos recently because my camera had a problem with the focus. That appears to be okay now. So this, the job for today is to get this bearing off this shaft. This is the old one off the wind turbine and you can see the bearing actually turns very freely. Hardly any noise at all. Just show you that again. So there's virtually no noise coming out of it and I know for a fact the one on the rear of the turbine is starting to give up and that's because I never got around to buying a proper grease thing. What I have to do now is I'm going to soak the hell out of it in WD-40 and leave it in the vise for a while. Nice lovely fresh can. Okay, so I'm going to leave that for at least an hour and then what I'll probably have to do is start taking the rust off with a grinder, but we'll leave that an hour and see what we've got. Cheers. Sweet. Right, I'm going to try this with the wrench. Sweet, straight off. To be fair, if you look at that, the end where it's obviously been hit a few times, so I'll need to get some sandpaper just to take care of that. Sweet. I'm just going to take the excess rust off. A bit more WD. And then if we're really lucky, it might come off. Just gonna put some WD in this hole here, which doesn't have a grub screw in. Finally going to squirt some more WD in and then we'll leave that for an hour and come back and start trying to knock the shaft off. Sweet. Right, it's been about an hour so let's see if we've got any movement. I'm just going to give it a couple of gentle taps and we'll see if we get anything. No, nothing happening there. Sweet, just got to leave it a bit longer and come back in a bit. Cheers. Right, let's see if we can get it shifted at all. Got some wipes to give it a good clean. Right, it's nearly done. I'm just going to hit it with a bit more wet and dry.
That's it, folks. It looks perfectly clean and it's very smooth. You have to remember, I think that might be rubber in there as well, so I can't thrash it with any kind of abrasive. I just want to see how easy this goes in now without getting it stuck in there. There you go. It's not perfectly smooth, but it's enough and it only needs to go right on the end of the shaft on the wind turbine. So thank you for watching. I shall put that on very soon. Keep a watch out. Cheers.